fight. So obviously I won that battle, right? As if, buddy. Oh, come on. I seriously, I won that. These Kagami robot things we came across are freaking awesome and a really interesting gift idea, I think, because they're so cool. If you like RC cars, remote control stuff, drones, you're going to love the Kamigami robots. And <laughs> these things are cool because they can do a whole lot of different things and they can be operated off your iPhone or off your Android, whatever you got, whatever kind of smart device you're working on. These things can be operated remotely from them and they're really cool. And what's even better about these things is that you can totally put them together with your family and with your kids. And let's real quick, let's show you how to put together a Kamigami robot before it kicks some ass. <sighs> Unless you have a problem with a lot of small parts and working with them, assembling the Kamigami is pretty easy. It comes with all the instructions. The only thing is that you do have to go online to check them out. But once you do, if you have any type of brand on your shoulder and you're even a little bit mechanically inclined, you can put this together. And like I said, what I really think is nice though, is that a father and son or a mother and daughter or any family members can get together and they can do this project together. And that's one great thing about it. It's the holidays. The holiday means spending time with your loved ones and opening this up on Christmas day and being able to assemble it with your child and watching their eyes light up as you start to play with it is an awesome thing. And one of the best things I think about this product. So now that you got the Kamigami assembled, what do you do? Well, it's simple. You simply download the app, install it, you're up and going. And then if you have either one or two or multiples of these different robots, you can connect to them. You'll see a screen comes up and it'll let you choose between the different robots you have. And then once you're in there, you can simply control it. And what's cool is you can change the different colors. There's three different color variations that you can do, but you do have total movement control over the robots. And there are even some things in there, which you guys will see, where you can actually fight and have fun with the thing. There's a few different modes that they offer for having fun and actually a challenge mode. But I think the biggest challenge and the fun stuff is just to go free for all and have fun like we did because obviously this shit's hours and hours of fun. And if you want to pull a prank and scare the crap out of somebody, oh, they have afraid of the dark mode. What is afraid of the dark mode? Well, when you turn out the lights, the little robot goes crazy. I guarantee you got some sleeping kid and you put that up by his bed and run that thing. He'll be jumping and screaming and praying for safety. The monster in their bed is going to scare the crap out of someone this Christmas holiday season. <gasps> and the sampler pack offers three different modes. Dance.
spinning in a circle, and zigzag. Like drunken boxer. Good stuff! Now you guys can see Buddy the dog, our co-host, he loves a little Kamigami robot. At first he's like, what the frack is this thing and what's it doing here? But he played with it a little bit. Now Roxy the cat though, as soon as she saw that shit, her ass took off and went into hiding. So we had to trap her with a dual robot attack. These little guys wanted to grab themselves some pussy. <coughs> All right guys, so I don't know about you, but this to me, this just farts fun everywhere because it is a lot of fun. Works great on carpet, pretty much on any surface, except for like dirt and rocks. We tried that, don't work on that at all and don't even waste your time, it's not really good for that. But any type of thing like that, even on your grass, it works okay. But you guys can see, this thing's just totally fun. And you can do it with a friend. You get two of them, you can do battle modes, all kinds of fun stuff. Now, I'll be admit, I'll be admit, I'll admit, the battle modes and stuff they have, the sumo mode and that stuff, it's kind of not really that much of a thing. Operating it and controlling it, having fun with it, using the night mode where it you know, does weird stuff, that's I think is a cooler thing. But you know, the sumo thing and the fighting thing, it's more fun to me if you learn how to control it better. And if you had a joystick, fuck, would it be much easier to control? As it is right now, trying to do that on the phone is kind of tricky, but you know, I'm sure there's some people out there that'd be really good at it because when you take these things from across the room and just ram them straight at each other, Man, that's just fun stuff. So at the end of the day, folks, we have information about these down below the like button. Hope you guys like this stuff. But if you're looking for an interesting gift, especially for a kid, these things are cool. Um, I wouldn't say they're for little tiny kids, you know what I mean? But a kid who has a you know, smart thinking brain who can understand this is gonna love the crap out of it. You can chase your pets with it. You can use it in the nighttime to play around and joke around with your family. All in all, I just think it's a lot of fun. I'm Eric, you've been watching Tekken tomorrow. Time to go kick Jesus' ass again. Wish.